It's telly time, people. Get involved. X Factor officials have rubbish reports the boot camp contestants are being plied with free booze in a bid to ramp up the scandal on this year's show. Bosses say there wasn't a free bar all night at the welcome party in London at the weekend. There aren't mini bars in the hotel rooms and they won't be filmed 24 7. The pool at boot camp is also out of bounds, despite rumours the wannabes were being encouraged to get in the hotel's hot tub. An X Factor spokesperson confirmed they take their responsibilities extremely seriously and the welfare of the contestants is of paramount importance. The welcome party was strictly supervised and the finalist house will be too. If Jeremy Clarkson says he drives at 207 miles per hour on the test track, then that is how fast he was going. The Top Gear host has hit out at claims a large percentage of the driving on the show is done by professionals rather than the presenters. The BBC admits pro drivers are used but insists they're only brought in for pickup shots. Jeremy says any claims he fakes road tests are utter rubbish. And finally, we can't wait to get a butcher's at this. EastEnders ledge Pam St. Clement is apparently ready to reveal 25 years of behind-the-scenes secrets from Albert Square. The actress who plays Pat Evans is reportedly publishing a tell-all autobiography, which will be released once she leaves Walford at Christmas. Pam is the second longest-serving cast member behind Adam Woodyett, who's played Ian Beale since the very first episode. That's your lot. More TV gossip tomorrow.